The Institute's president, Ken Okbara, says the donation is to the School of Business Studies for the advancement of the study of banking and finance in the country. Members of the Chartered Institute of Bankers of Nigeria were in Nasarawa State on Wednesday to commission the 160 capacity sitting hall. Present at the event were the governor of the state and officials of the state government, traditional rulers, members of state chapter of the Chartered Institute of Bankers of Nigeria, as well as other dignitaries. President of the Institute Ken Okbara, while commissioning the edifice, said the banking hall will serve as a meeting point melting pot for the training and development of future bankers on contemporary banking technique. This edifice will be known and called the CIBN Bankers Hall. It will serve as the melting pot for the training and development of future ready bankers. The facility is a 160-seater lecture theater fully furnished and equipped with ultra-modern facilities. I do not have doubt that this structure will serve as an important tool in delivery of high-quality education to young upcoming bankers. I therefore would like to seize this opportunity to urge the students who are the ultimate beneficiary to use the facility responsibly so that it can serve successive generations. I also want to appeal to the management to give priority attention to maintenance of this beautiful edifice so that it can retain its functional utility and aesthetic value. In his response, Director Al Hassan Abdullahi lauded the initiative, stressing that infrastructure has been a major challenge for the institution as he called on other professional bodies to follow suit. Inadequacy of infrastructure is among the major challenges in this institution due to continuous increase in staff and students' population. As such, this project will surely assist in addressing some of our major challenges. On behalf of the entire community of the Federal Protective Minister, I therefore wish to wholeheartedly express our profound appreciation and gratitude to the Council and management of CIBN for contributing generously towards the development of this great project, great polytechnic. This beautiful edifice is strategically located at the center of our campus to suggest to the world what CIBN has done for us. And it is our firm belief that this project will certainly cushion the effect of our infrastructure needs and further provide conducive environment for teaching and learning, especially in the areas of banking and finance. Responding to the gesture from CIBN, Subdean in the department says, the project is a necessity for the study of banking and finance, a position supported also by the representative of the students who said that the students have for long yearned for such a project. The School of Business Study, no doubt, stand tall in the midst of other schools within the prestigious institution. The Federal Protecting Nasara is an important project. Indeed, the project becomes a necessity as well as a plus, an instrument of efficiency to the staff and students of Banking and Finance Department and the entire Protecting community in general. I want to say a big thank you to the CIBN for this laudable legacy project for the honor repeated on us. This project is one of its kind and it has been our yearning and aspiration to have a befitting lecture hall, well equipped and free from distraction. Today our yearnings and aspiration has come to a realization through the donation of this bankers hall. We promise to handle these facilities with care and ensure proper maintenance from time to time. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.